public schools in Woburn forced to close as teachers go on strike. Negotiations between the teachers union and the city have not yet led to a deal. And now families are wondering what happens tomorrow. We were wondering why are teachers able to strike when it's illegal under Massachusetts law. WBZ's Christina Hager has some answers in tonight's Question Everything. You are amazing. I'll be standing with you in solidarity the whole way. We know it's illegal. They know it's illegal. And yet, teacher strikes happen in Massachusetts. We know this is not, this is an illegal strike. This, we want to be in our classrooms right now. We don't want to be out here. City and state attorneys asked a judge to order an end to this strike with an injunction imposing fines if it continues. Glenn Kucher heads the Massachusetts Association of School Committees. I think I'd be quarterbacking the Super Bowl before uh, teachers were given the right to strike because public employees do not have that right in Massachusetts. So why hasn't that law prevented not only this, but other strikes that recently shut down classes in Brookline, Malden, and Haverhill, where the union there had to pay $250,000 for strike costs, plus a $110,000 court fine. Legal expert Nicholas Dominello says it's because the punishment may not be so punishing. So they're paying a one-time fine. Typically, it's around $50,000. Some cases, it's more. Some cases, it's less. And then that results in a union receiving a forever benefit, higher wages that are um, perpetually in their collective bargaining agreement going forward. They strike as the last resort. For years, Massachusetts State Senator Becca Rausch has been pushing to legalize strikes like this. The right to strike is a really basic, uh, one of the most fundamental elements of organized workers' rights. The folks who are fighting hard are fighting hard for our teachers and our not just our teachers, but our, our families, our students. They can afford it. But experts say the law isn't likely to change. And either way, this we fight, we is still happening. In Woburn, Christina Hager. WBZ News. Now, if you have a question you want us to answer, send us an email to question everything at cbsboston.com. You can also tweet us using the hashtag WBZ question everything.